Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. This week's DCM report is going to be a special treat for you fans of camp because it's a film which ranks as one of the best of the really bad monster movies from Japan. I do encourage you to have a look, though. I mean, this film is so bizarre and so strange and at times so unapologetically preposterous, it's nearly impossible not to watch it. The title is The X from Outer Space. It came out in 1967. It was the first kaiju film from the Japanese film company Shochiko. Now, kaiju is a Japanese word that literally means strange or mysterious beast. Now, the most famous kaiju would have to be Godzilla. And it was the success of Godzilla movies made by the Toho Studios in Japan, which prompted Toho's main competitor to try their hand at making a film about a mysterious beast, their answer to Godzilla. Well, Shochiko was that competing company. And they were Japan's oldest film company and responsible for the careers of such an outstanding filmmaker as Akira Kurosawa. Well, the result of their foray into creating a movie monster brings us to a half-lizard, half-chicken monster born from alien spores. This film we're about to see has become a cult classic since its original release, not only because of its unorthodox monster or the fact that the scientists in this movie seem much more interested in drinking cocktails than in their space mission, but also because of the pedigree of the cast, which includes the highly respected Japanese actor Eiji Okada, who appeared in a number of very important films at the time, including 1963's American film The Ugly American with Marlon Brando. So here from 1967, The X from Outer Space. <laughs> 